No dreams, nightmares. No. Well, that's surprising. Out of the academy less than a year. Not off probation, even. And involved in a shooting. Not many of us could go through what you have and remain so unaffected. It says here your badge saved your life. Ironically. What? I almost didn't accept it. They gave me the option. It belonged to someone before me. Who? Never asked. He's dead. Whoever it was, he's apparently become your guardian angel.
Let's cut the crap, dear. Let's talk about what happened that night. I told the IA board everything. What you told the board was to save your job. What you tell me is to save your life. You can talk to me, Dan. Nobody will ever know. You can tell me anything. A guy shot me. A guy, dear. Yeah. Didn't he have a name? Castro. Nicky Castro. He killed my partner for it. He killed my partner before she could fire. And then what? Then I, I shot him once, and uh, he shot me twice. I shot him one more time, and then I passed out. Just like in the report. Just like in the report. Look, I need to get back up you on the need street. need to? Well, I want to. You think you've got something to prove, Dan? No. Yourself, somebody else? No. Want to get even, maybe? No. I need... All right. I'm going to recommend that you be assigned to the 2-9. The 2-9. You wanted action, right? That's what you said, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I said. Well, the department requires my determination that you're fit to return to duty. I don't believe it. You just said... That's why you will be working inside. Records. Until we can talk a few more times. How many more times? Until you're willing to share the burden. Dan. You can trust me. You have friends you can talk to? I've got you, right? after you were hit. Once before and once after. Impressive. Especially after your uh, instructor at the academy said you were somewhat intimidated by firearms. I... You and I are close? You and deep, I mean? Joyce was a good T.O. She taught you a lot, I'll bet. Suckers actually subpoenaed me. Mrs. Sampson. He's the hero of the teeth when she bought it. You wanted me? Put Sampson here to work. Sampson. Whenever I ask for cops, I'm told there's not enough to go around. Yet, without my asking, you show up. Makes me wonder why. Sampson. Close the door on your way out. Here. You got a problem with the captain? Just met him. Doesn't answer my question. Look, I want to punch the clock, do my work, and go home, okay? Didn't mean to snap at you. That one's for you. Sorry. Very good. You tight? Will. 
I'm good. Because I know. Not anymore. Arthritis. Fucking humidity causes it, you know? I'm not going to worry about that anymore in a few weeks. Retiring. Idaho. Full pension. Fun and sun. What do I do with all this stuff? Ah, dump anywhere. Is it always so, uh... Disorganized? Only since the commission cranked up. Commission? Where do you live? On the moon? The mayor's commission on corruption. Right out loud. This precinct's the center of the whole investigation. Now, that's why they subpoenaed all our records. That's why you and I are going to get rich in overtime. See, they sent them up here from the warehouse downtown, and we sort them out for the special prosecutors. Anybody been charged? Oh, yeah. This place is dirty as a pig's tit. Mostly small potatoes, though. Now you think they're going to bust some big crime ring? When the dust settles, all they'll find is a few free donuts and some fixed tickets. They come after you? Me? No. Hell, I misplaced my files the first day I got here. about Hunt and uh, his friend. The guy's in the other room. Yerkes. Can I give you some advice? Everyone else does. This is a dangerous place to be a new face. And people are scared for their jobs or pensions. Everybody's going to assume that you're a plant. At least you prove otherwise. You should be just one of the boys. Show them right off whose side you're on. at all today. I don't drink anymore, but I still play a hell of a good game of eight ball. Care to join me? No. Thanks. Change your mind and catch me down the locker room. Otherwise, I'll be at Cliff's. Yeah, just around the corner. Yeah, have a good one. Oh, what made you want to be a cop? 
<laughs> Father was no APD. Is that right? Well, he must be proud you follow in the footsteps and all. <laughs> Surprised more than proud, I think, if he was around. Uh, he's dead. Died about a year and a half ago. I'm sorry. It's all right. But he didn't have to spend much time to get in the last couple of years with us. I wasn't very good at the things that he thought were important. Except wearing the blue. Even that is uh, questionable. Man, that's a bad habit to get into. What? Selling yourself short. Look, what you've been through ain't exactly a secret. Well, nobody expects you to act like nothing happened. I've served 20 years, nearly all of it in narcotics. And I've seen a lot of people made dead. And I can tell you one thing for certain. It changes everybody, sometimes in ways they don't expect. Thanks, Don. Mm -hmm. You know that, that, that badge thing? It's just a hunk of brass. Don't confuse what it represents with who you are. Hey, you're off, Miller. Hey, I'll be right there. You never feel you need somebody. Somebody to talk it through. Somebody that's been there. I, mean, I got good ears. Rag them up, suckers. Looks <laughs> <laughs> like the low ball rapidly disappearing. You two have something in common. I don't know what you're talking about. I think you do. Hey, you're both heroes if you think because you work for the commission. Ain't nobody can touch you. That's enough, Eddie. Easy, Eddie. Just a kid. Son of a bitch. Early bird gets the worm, right? Yeah, what the early worm get? I'm not punched in. I've got an appointment. I'll be back in a couple hours. Hey, thanks for last night. Ah, oh, Yerkes, he's an ass what? Sarge, did you ever run into a cop named Manuel Torres? Uh, we went through SAT together. SAT? Substance abuse therapy. Manny loved Jose Cuervo even more than I like Jack and Bud. 
Do you know where I could get his personnel jacket? In the cellar. Well, what's this all about? You know the term dead badge? Oh, cop dies, eventually his uh, badge is recirculated. New cop gets a number. You got Manny's shield? It saved my life. Jesus H. Christ. Uh, you uh, mentioned this to Rice? You know Dr. Rice? Uh, she, she, she runs the SAT program. But how could you know that I was seeing her? She called. And? Well, and nothing. She, she asked that I watch out for you, is all. Watch out for me? Yeah. You can trust me, you said. No one will ever know. You said that, too. Miller's worried about you. I'm worried about you. I am not crazy, for Christ's sakes. I don't need a keeper. So what's this thing with Manny Torres? Jesus. Did Hoskins also tell you I had bran flakes for breakfast? That took a crap about 9.30? Damn it, Samson. I'm trying to help you here. But I can't do anything if you won't help yourself. This is a psychiatric discharge. I sign it and you're out. You can't. Well, I can and I will. For the next cop whose life depends on your being able to pull that trigger. I did it once. I can do it again. I studied the testimony, Samson. I don't buy it. It's true. I don't think you killed anybody. I did. The board reviewed it. The board? The board just wants every shooting to come down right. All they care about is the department's image. All I care about is you. Talk to me, Samson. Tell me what really happened. It's in the report. All right. Go back to work. Samson. A Tories thing. Drop it. Samson. Manny Torres.
Excuse me, guys. Do you happen to know the uh, cop that used to live there? Uh, a guy named Manny Torres, Manuel Torres? Nah, we don't know nobody, Holmes. Maricón! I'm looking for anyone who knew Manuel Torres. Oh, yeah. I knew Manny. ¿Qué haces, pendeja? I uh, spent some time in a shelter with his wife. Would you like something to drink? I like $20. he like? Depends. And who you ask? I'm asking you. <sighs> he was loved by everybody. He was hated by everybody. What about when he died? Lagrimas. A lot of tears. But still, we was glad. Because of the way he died, he proved that he was no better than any of us. The way he died? P.O.D., guapo. Smack. Like a common drug addict. Mrs. Torres. Who are you? 
Officer Samson. Dan Samson? What do you want? You're Billy Torres, right? So? Well, I was wondering if I could just have a word with you. I'll be late for work. Uh, it's about your husband. But have you finally decided to pay his death benefits? I, I don't know anything. Then I don't have time to talk to you. Please, please. I was a friend. I don't remember you. Well, I mean, it wasn't exactly... Look, I don't know what kind of scam you're pulling, and I don't I, care. I just want to find out about Manny. Well, you're you know, too late. Many... When Manny died, do you know how many cops came to his funeral? Do you? No, I'm sorry, I don't. Three. No flags, no white gloves, no testimonials, no pension. He was an embarrassment to the department. That's what they told me. Now I'm telling you what I told them. Go fuck yourself. I'm supposed to be cutting five minutes ago. What can I do for you? Um, I'm going over the Torres case. You know who? Manuel Torres. I pulled his pathology report from your records room. Uh, did you do the autopsy? Well, is my name on it? Yeah. yeah. Well, then I did it. What I wanted to know is, do junkies always shoot in their arms? Junkies will shoot into any vein that hasn't collapsed. What precinct did you say you were from? The, um... The 2-9. Your report suggests that Torres was a habitual user. But the only puncture marks were found in his left arm. Yeah. You get to the point? Well... All of these marks have scabs. It's not like some are fresh and some are new. And are, you, are, are you questioning my findings? Well, I mean... That's no, because if you are, I suggest you file for an official review. No, no. Until I, then, I, I have much better things to do. What do you want? The name is Wheeler. I'm an investigator for the commission. I understand that you know something about the Torres case. What? No. No. Uh, wait. No, what? No. Uh, uh, listen. For what it's worth, I never believed a guy like Torres would OD either. I think you and I can help each other. get a W-34 up on this. How old? Two years. You don't. They get shipped down to the warehouse on Water Street after 14 months. This isn't about that Torres thing, is it? 
I called Rice. She wants you to come in now. Today. Damn, this is crazy. I just got a call from the car. Uh, Captain, could I... You stay the fuck out of it. I don't like what he had to say. You're putting me in a shitty spot. If I transfer you, the people downtown think I got something high. If I don't, the 29 people think I sold them out. So I'm going to tell you this for the last time. You keep sticking your nose where it doesn't belong, I can guarantee I won't be there to keep from getting it busted. Find what you need? Yeah. Just what I need. your husband killed himself yeah I don't either but can you prove that maybe And the lady will have a... Café, por favor. Café, tequila. Gracias. You understand Spanish? I had a, a year in junior high, so I could maybe read a menu or find the banos, you know. <laughs> Banos. I'll correct you if you get lost. I'm counting on it. So what's this all about? You're gonna think I'm crazy. Maybe I already do. This was Manny's. A number, I mean. Mine now. I don't get it. Did Manny give this to you? I've never met your husband. I, I, I know this must seem a little bizarre. A little? Maybe we should just forget about it. No. Please. Café para la señorita? Tequila para el joven. ¿Han decidido qué? ¿Comer? Bueno. So 
Whoa. Too bad I don't have any of my feet. You're not like most of them, you know. Them? Cops. Now, what's that supposed to mean? Cops and criminals are cut from the same cloth. Most of them could play either part. But not you. You're different, I think. <laughs> I meant that as a compliment, you know. <laughs> My old man wouldn't have seen it that way. No? No. Is he still around? No. He smoked two packs of cigarettes every day for 30 years. Ended up in the hospital. Stroke cancer. When they found out, I went to see him. I asked him how he was. He never answered me. Maybe he couldn't, I don't know. Instead, he pulled out a pack underneath his pillow. He knew I didn't smoke, but he offered me one anyways. We both lit up. Never said a word. When the cigarettes were gone, I left. He died that night. Sounds like a hard man. Yeah. Very. Any brothers and sisters? Ex-wives? Current wives? Girlfriends? Lovers? Look, it's getting late. We should probably go. Dan? I'm sorry if I upset you. I didn't mean to. Just not talk about me anymore, okay? Talk about you, and then. Where do you want me to start? How, how did you meet him? I was 15. I ran away from Brownsville in Texas. And I ended up in a shelter here in Long Beach. By 19, I was in charge of the place. Go on. Manny was in Vice then. Um, he used to bring us the youngest girls. The salvageables, he'd call them. Anyway, he and I hit it off and... How come? How come what? Uh, how come... How come you hit it off? Manny was, was never lost like I had been. He always knew who he was. He always liked himself. Some thought he liked himself a little too much. Anyway, he protected me. Made me feel safe. That's why I accepted him as he was. That's why I know he could never have OD'd. Excuse me? My son. He's the best part of Manny. Someday when... With a little help from my mother-in-law. He'll grow up to be the man Manuel should have been.
KDOs too. Oh, we go. Que Dios te oiga. What does that mean? May God hear you. Billy, in, in Manny's things, his personal stuff, from his desk and his, his uh, locker, did you ever see any kind of logbook? I don't know. Why? Well, I thought it might show us what kind of work he was up to, you know? Help us figure out why somebody... I would... still have what they gave me. I never opened it. You have it here? Yeah. Can I see it? Oh, Dan, it's, it's late. Right. No notebook. Not much at all. What's there on an overdue payment on a 78 Chevy is all he left us. If it weren't for my mother-in-law doing daycare, we couldn't survive. Who's this? That's Manny and his homie, Joey Gomez. Homie? Was he in a gang? Do you remember what I said about cops and robbers? The same cloth and all that. Manny was a gangster before he was a cop. Well, what became of Joey? They found his body six months before Manny was killed. It's like I told you. When Manny became a cop, he just joined the gang whose colors were blue. What about the girl? Her name is Selena Rojas. She's a whore. A drug addict. The police said she's the one who supplied Manuel with the heroin that killed him. Do you know where she is? No. Did you think it would be that easy? Oh, I, don't, I don't know what I thought. You want some coffee oh, or no. something? No, thanks. I don't want to apologize for the way I acted in the restaurant. I shouldn't have been prying. I, sh I should probably be going. Dan. I appreciate what you're trying to do. For Manny, I mean. I don't think it'll do any good, but... I'll be here if you need me.
shit up to your fucking eyeballs. You made it easy for me. If internal affairs sent you in, that proves how stupid they are. If they didn't, that proves how stupid you are. Either way, Samson, you're gone. What about the other car? Fighting with all that was the alcohol level found in your blood. Somebody was trying to kill Over a few thousand bucks worth of damage to private property. What about the other car? Uh, while still on probation. I'm afraid the closer you ever come to wearing a uniform, kid, is as a security guard in some mall. To try to warn you. <laughs> How do you feel? I'm not surprised. What happened? I got in an accident. Slip on the ice, did you? Let's finish cleaning you up. Hey, hey. What? Thanks. Thanks for what? For not shooting me.
call it an escape, a flight from reality. I just don't remember anything. That's typical. Why is this happening to me? Well, fugues generally are the result of internal emotional conflict. A soldier, for example, in combat feels he has committed a cowardly act. Now, outwardly, he wants to re-engage the enemy to get even, but inwardly, he's afraid that he will revert to the same cowardice. So, uh, he chooses another persona. Someone who fulfills his image of what a brave soldier should be. And simply, he becomes that person. Could it happen again? Unless you send Manny Torres back to his grave. Billy? I don't want you here. I'm sorry. I said I don't want you here. I just want to explain. No. Please? Llévalo a su casa, por favor. No! Sí. Haz lo que te digo, mijo. It's all right. You scared the hell out of me when you ran out of here. And when I saw what you did to your arm... I, I know. I scared the hell out of myself. Billy, I'm in trouble. I've been seeing the department psychologist. It's a requirement after a shooting. Shooting? What shooting? My partner, she, she was uh, killed. And I, uh... What? I panicked. I saw her there on the ground, and, and uh, it was like I was paralyzed. I let him down. Them? Who? My partner. My father. Come inside. When it's all over, you don't remember anything. It's like Manny invaded me. I like you, Dan. You are different than other men I know. Why are you different? Look, I want to help. Too weird for me. I don't know what it is I could... Just be there for me. If I need you, that's, that's all I'm asking. Please. Looks like shit. Needle marks in his arm were all fresh. They were all done at the same time. What makes you think? Photographs in the coroner's office. I'll check it out. What else? The memo in uh, Torres's file said that Billy got his logbook. She said she didn't. Stuff gets lost all the time. 
Sometimes on purpose. It's thin. More coffee? Uh-uh. No thanks. I hear Hunt's gonna burn you. If that's what you paid for this, it was overpriced. Hey, listen, I, I don't need you on my conscience, Samson. Eventually, Yerkes and all the other wrong cops in the 2-9 are going to step on their dicks anyway. Now, maybe you ought to back off of this thing when you still can. Hello? Me. So what did he say? That he'd look into it. That's all? And to drop it. So what are you going to do? Find Selena Rojas. That's crazy. You can't. I'll call back in an hour. Dan. for Selena Rojas. You know her? I might. Wait, wait, wait. You give me money and then you drive off? That don't look so good. Come with me. I'll tell you about Selena. You got a quarter. I'm not interested. Don't pay, can stay. You got the biggest melones in town. Those kids have got a lot of guys in trouble. Just the wallet. No problems. It's a copy of my gun.
can't come back here. Selena? Who wants her? Benny Torres. Benny's dead. to share this pie? Hey. He'd like to share the needle too, huh? Who are you? Is that why Manny's dead? Somebody made him dead. It wasn't me. I don't believe you. I don't give a fuck. I love Manny. He cared about me. Got me into a program. Made me clean. The police report said you're the one that gave him the stuff that killed him. Just because some asshole writes that down don't make it true. So you didn't give him the heroin? Many wouldn't even smoke a joint, much less do smack. Is that what you told the police? Why not? It's the truth. Long Nobody just come in. What room? It ain't worth it. Oro, quanto vale? Vinte e cinco. She gave him the smack? Huh? I'm gonna repaint these walls with your fucking brains right no. now. That's not the way you wrote it up, is it? Is it? No. What about the logbook? What logbook? Damn it, Carl! All right, I took it! Por que? Por que? Don't. Please. <laughs> Christ, what are you doing here?
I don't think I did. I, I don't know. I, I just get confused when... Jesus, this. what am I doing here? You're helping me find your husband's killer. How'd you know that? Hans issued a warrant. What? They know that you were with Yerkes when they bought it. They got two wits. They think I did it? Well, they're calling you a material witness now. Turn yourself in, Samson. I'll do what I can to help. Tonight, 2.30, Terminal Island. Meet me at the rail yard. Samson. Let's go. Hello, Thomas. What do you want? We want to talk to you. It's about Joey. I'm in the middle of the game. And I'm winning. Por favor. It's important. Did you know that Manny was looking for Joey's killer? He's yeah, just a people. Está bien. Es un amigo. Manny had pieced together part of a puzzle. Looking for what's in this book had got him killed. Who were these men, Tomas? They worked together. Joey and this man. Kind of work. Smurfing. What? Money laundering. For who? Traficantes, Colombians. I don't know. Is that what you told Manny? What else did he ask you? <laughs> Same thing a lot of people in the street want to know. What's that? Whatever happened to the suitcases. Somebody killed Joey and his pals and took it. And it could have been anybody. Anybody who knew where Joey and the others were setting up shop to distribute the cash packets. Hide the money. Lock yourself in. Wait. I'll be back in a couple hours. I thought you said you were a I know what I said. I know become. what I said. And now you don't care? They killed Manny. And they'll kill you too. I was wrong about you, Dan. You're not different after all. Castro and the others? Nobody had to know. He told me he worked in narcotics. 
You were staking them out. You and your partner, what's his name? Uh, Fell. Aaron Fell. And you knew they had the cash the nights that you hit them, didn't you? When he's in hundreds, two million dollars from each distributor, two million for each of us. And all you had to do was kill them. Well, that was the easy part. They were scum. I risked my life, Dan, to grab guys like this. Then they'd pay some sharp lawyer with pocket change and laugh at me on the way back to the street. As many to as scum? You know what my retirement is, Dan? 21.5 a year. After taxes, at 15 bills a month. And you shut him up with a hot shot, didn't you? I tried to reason with him. I tried to tell him how I deserved it. Did Manny Torres right? deserve to die in a dumpster like a fucking junkie? <laughs> Feld, they're ripping off money mules. How do you know? Hoskins timesheet showed him working a money laundering ring. All four of the guys involved have ended up dead, including Nicky Castro, a man that was shot the same night that my partner was killed. Another guy that they hit was Joey Gomez, who's a friend of Manny Torres. They tried to pay Torres off, and when he didn't go for it, they OD'd him. Go on. Each of them were carrying two million dollars. None of the money has ever turned up. Hmm? And you think that Hoskins lifted him? I know he did. Uh, Hoskins, his partner Feld, and your keys. They're all in on it. The reason I know this is because Hoskins told me the whole thing. like a good idea at the time. I tried to keep you out of this, Dan. We really did. Jesus, your Aaron fell. Oh. No! Give my regards to Manny Torres.
How did I get here? You suffered another episode, Dan. How did she get? I called her. You thought you were Manny. I didn't know what else to do. You need to be hospitalized, Dan. I wouldn't let her take you. I was afraid they'd arrest you. They won't. Not now. <laughs> Not after I tell them what I found out. Put it down, Samson. Who are you? He's the man who killed your husband. What? He and his partners, Hoskins and Yerkes. They killed Joey. And when Manny found out, they killed him too. You bastard! Surprise me, Samson. I didn't think you had it in you. Not the way you acted that rainy night. The way you shook when your partner went down. How could you know what I... You? You killed Joyce? Let's get the hell out of here. We don't have to... Two million dollars each. That's what Hoskins said. Four dead mules, four partners. Get the tickets out of his pocket. Do it. Did you kill them all? I didn't know anything about the first three. Until Torres told you. I'm impressed. You might have made a good cop after all. Manny was in my detox program. I was his counselor. He told me everything, even about his friend, Joey Gomez. And then you sold him out to Hoskins considerably more than 30 pieces of silver. Now, get me the case you took from your keys. You have everyone else's. Isn't six million dollars enough? It's not about the money, Samson. It's about winning, about being the last person standing. Now, get me the goddamn case. Now! Who's got the gun? Who's gonna pull the trigger, Torres or Samson? I went to your apartment. When you didn't answer, I buzzed the super. He sent me up here. <sighs> so, how'd the hearing go? Okay. Well, what did they decide? To discharge me. Psychiatric disability. Damn. It's okay. I would have quit anyway. So what now? We bury the dead. We see who's left. Uh... 